So as you can see, these drains, they're clearing, they're clearing. The septic tank is working as it should. So I'm gonna run around here real quick. This is the clean out on the side of the building. I was flushing it out so to get clear camera footage. And I noticed that the line was filling up with water. And there's the water. And that water is about a foot. It's a foot down in that line at this point. This is the clean out on the side of the building. All of this white debris you see around that is from where it has backed up. So in between this clean out and this clean out around back, which is approximately 150 foot away, there is a belly in the line that's going to be about a foot and a half belly at the center of that belly. That's how deep it is. It, from that first video footage I sent when I was running the camera through this first, the clean out, this is the rear of the building. I showed where the water level was and it was about a foot deep. Foot and, well, really it was about a foot and a half deep at this clean out. So up at the clean out, up there, it's also a foot and a half deep to the bottom of the clean out. And that water you hear running is water that from, I've got the sinks inside the building, the sinks are running. And also I had a water hose running to that clean out just to flush the lines out to clear them out so I could get clear camera footage. Well, I can't really get clear camera footage because the belly in the line, it holds so much water. Everything is built at a level point to where that water sits a foot and a half deep in each clean out. So when you flush a toilet, it has to push it has to push that down.